Hey, Dave we like here with something special. Apple TV just launched on Roku. This is my Roku Ultra 2019 edition, which is also 4K compatible. And that's nice because the Apple TV app comes with 4K content. Pretty cool. All right, so you can see I did load up the shallows previously. Um, and we've got watch now at the very top, movies, TV shows, as well as you have kids and your general library. This is neat though that the library, if you've connected it with like your movies anywhere account, it'll display all that content as well. So that's why I have a couple movies here that I didn't buy through Apple, but they are available. And that is what the exit looks like. So let's go ahead and go into watch now. What's cool is there's what to watch and it just really like quickly highlights what it is that you know is new to the channel that I should really check on out. It also of course promotes Apple TV Plus which is coming November 1st. So we can swipe through various shows. If we click on them we can say add to up next. I'm not sure what up next means but it means something. It probably means like watch it later if you feel like it. There are There is a trailer that's nice and you can see who's a part of the show and click on to find out more of the content that that person's a part of as well, which is great. And then there's an about section. So it looks very similar to Apple TV on Apple TV. Now, also you'll see that there's free series premieres. Now this is great because you can go ahead and watch content for free without subscribing, just like you can on the Roku channel. So I was able to see this uh, on Becoming a God on Showtime for free, the first episode. And you'll see that it's in high definition. There's noteworthy, some new TV content. And of course, there's the Apple TV channels. So you can go ahead and subscribe through the Apple TV channel to get content from various other channels. So if I click on Acorn TV, I can go ahead and subscribe for $5.99 a month after a seven day free trial. So you can see lots of content that they have as well. Um, so there's that free on Apple TV uh, section and other sections as well. So these are just categories real fast. So let's go back on up to our shallows. And what you'll see that this is going to actually display in 4K, which is really, really cool. Whenever it feels like loading on up, right? See how fast that was. And from there, if I hit the down button on the D-pad, I can see that there are subtitles, audio, etc. And then if I click the back button, it allows me to play from the beginning or get some more information about the movie. If I click on, I should be able to adjust the captions with the star button as well. Let me just go ahead and load the movie back on up and click on star once it starts playing. So you can see the movies there. And so there are some options when I click on the star button, audio track volume accessibility. So I should be able, no. Yeah, it looks like, okay. Use that down button on the D-pad to adjust the subtitles. Apparently that's how it has to be done within the Apple TV. Let's look at what else is going on. So now in the movie section, what's cool is, notice that in the upper left-hand corner, 4K HDR, so we can easily identify which movie is in 4K and HDR as well. Lion King is out, very cool. Lots of movies to check out and various categories to go along with them. Yeah, so they've brought basically their on-demand movies as well as subscription via their channels. And there's all this TV content to watch. Of course, lots of new Apple TV Plus content coming soon. So if I go ahead and click on one of these, Magnum PI for example, let's see what happens. It seems frozen. There it is. And so it says try CBS L access for free.
The purge is on USA. Let's see what that says. It's a little sluggish to load. I'm on Wi-Fi 6 and a gig down for internet speed. So you can go ahead and buy it. There we go. Finally loaded everything. And then again, kids has lots of kid friendly content to watch, which is great. Makes it really easy to find, you know, stuff that is fine for the whole family. And again, your library. So you got you got your various uh, TV shows, movies, etc. With search available as well, which is great that it shows you trending movies and TV shows. So lots of content available on the Apple TV channel on Roku. So go ahead and download it if you haven't done so already. I'll put a link in the description field below. All right, so this is Dave We Like wrapping it all up. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any comments or questions, leave them in the comment section below. I'll see you all in the next video, so be sure to subscribe for more.